Hello, we're here today with uh, Chris Carberry, CEO of Explore Mars. Um, uh, thanks for joining us, Chris. Well, thanks for having me on. Um, can you tell us a little about Explore Mars and the Humans to Mars Summit? Well, Explore Mars is a nonprofit based in the U.S. We do a lot of policy programming. We do STEM education work, technical projects, and we do topical programs. Like the biggest conference we have of the year is the Humans to Mars Summit, which is going on right now. And so it's the biggest event uh, in the world focused on sending humans, humans to Mars. And so it's going on, started yesterday, is going through tomorrow, and then we're going to Capitol Hill. But we've had, you know, huge number of speakers talking about how we're going to get there, the science of Mars, entertainment. We had a Hollywood and Mars panel yesterday with people talking about, yeah, Andy Weir, who wrote The Martian, was on it. Uh, National Geographic, who is a six-part series that Ron Howard's doing with them, was on. And there's another film that's coming out. So it was very interesting discussion. We also talked about virtual reality and space exploration. So covering a lot of different topics and trying to show this isn't just about, you know, just important to people in the space exploration community, but it's, you know, important for the, all of society. There are lots of interesting aspects to it, and it's going to get more and more exciting over the next few years. So, um, what do you think of the this year's H2M Summit so far? Going very well. You know, we had a good audience yesterday. I think we'll probably have around total number of people, around 600, I think. And um, we have people also tuning in, you know, thousands of people around the world tuning in on the webcast as well. So, you know, we've had a pretty good audience and a huge online audience and just getting a lot of good reviews, lots of good questions all around the world. So I'm very happy with the way it's going. Uh, sure. Um, so um, after this event, uh, you're doing the Mars Day on the Hill. Um, can you tell us a little about that? Yeah, we're actually we're doing a lot of things on the Hill as part of that. We're first starting off and having a panel discussion to brief, brief the U.S. Senate. So we have, we're going to have a group of people giving an overview, just showing that we can do this. We can get to Mars. So we'll have engineers, scientists. We'll also have Andy Weir on that and others talk about the goal. But then we're going to deliver the new Humans to Mars report that we released yesterday. We're going to deliver that to every single congressional office, all 535 offices. Then tomorrow we're going to be sitting down with about 40 or 50 uh, offices, you know, sit-down meetings, basically to talk to them about why they should support human missions to Mars. So it should be a lot of fun. It's going to be a very busy few days. I bet. Um, so um, what recommendations do you have for um, people who want to show their support for missions to Mars but can't be part of the day on the hill? Well, yeah, best way for people, at least in the U.S., to show support for humans' missions to Mars is uh, to write their members of Congress, uh, their representatives or senators. They just go to the, you know, Senate.gov or House.gov. You can easily email your um, elected officials or even go to WhiteHouse.gov and they can email the president. You know, the president's not going to give a direct answer, but they do monitor that and they like people when they see a lot of support for a particular issue, that does have an impact. And, you know, if they're inclined, they can also write letters to the editor or op-ed saying why they think this should be a goal of the United States. So that's, that's, those are probably the best ways for people who can't get involved, you know, coming to the Hill, you know, reaching out to their elected officials or writing letters to the editor. Okay. Um, uh, that's all the questions I've got. Um, anything you'd like to add? Not particular. I think, you know, we're having a great event, so I hope people, if they want to actually view the conference, they can. They don't have to be here in Washington, D.C. They go to our website, if they go to the conference website at h2m.exploremars.org, they can link into the webcast. And all of yesterday's events will already be up. It'll be recorded. So they'll be able to watch yesterday, you know, watch the recordings. And so, or they can watch today live. So anybody, any, anybody around the world who's watching your, uh, uh, your program, they can just come, you know, link onto our website and watch the conference. Yeah, and I'll be sure to link to that in the um, video description here when I get posted. All right, well, great. It was great to be on. Uh, thank you. All right, thanks. Have a good day. You too. Okay, bye.